This is a case study on Sam. He is a 10-year-old Aboriginal boy. He has been placed in the care of the minister under a parental responsibility order until he reaches 18 years old. Sam has been placed in short-term foster care with Aboriginal carers from a church-based fostering agency until a long-term placement can be found for him. He has been getting along with his foster carers, going to school and getting familiar with his new environment. A few months after Sam arrived, his carers and their support worker agreed that Sam should start talking to his mother on the phone. Lately, Sam has been acting differently. Leave me alone. I do not want to talk to you. Go away. Hello, Paul. It's Corrine, Sam's carer. Hi, Corrine. Is everything okay? Well, I am worried about Sam. He talked to his mom on the phone last night. The next thing I know, Sam's thrown the phone down and ran to his room. He's been crying all night but refuses to talk to us. He screamed at me to leave him alone. Is this the first time he has reacted like that? It's happening more often now whenever he speaks to his mum. Last night he refused to eat dinner and he was still crying when I woke up this morning. The phone call has really upset him. I am really concerned for him. What should we do?